morning. I have had New York, New York stuck in my head for the last day and a half. That's okay, because I kind of like it. We are about to meet Large Pizza, who is bringing us some trail magic. He is part of the Hudson Valley Hikers, uh, Jason and the Argonauts group. And so I've hiked with him quite a bit in the past. Excited to see him again. It's been a little while. Memories. I remember this section from the last time I did it. Up there was a real steep descent. And right here, I remember thinking, man, my knees hurt. <laughs> it's funny how things change when you just hike every single day for three months or so. It's nothing, it's nothing, it's fine. Cheers. Welcome to New York. Check out this everything bagel with breakfast stuff on it. Yes, we are truly in New York. Thank you very much to Trail Angel Large Pizza. Oh my goodness. Would you like to tell us what you hiked and how you got your trail name perhaps? Oh, um, I hiked a little trail called the Pacific Crest Trail oh, in 2017. Trail. <laughs> and um, It's little. I got my trail name because I was convinced I had hiker hunger at mile 150 and ordered oh. way too much food and um, lost my appetite right before it showed up and everybody took my food and helped me finish it. Uh, that food was a large pizza. Which, I like that story. Uh, yeah, so a couple miles later someone's like, I thought about it. Your name is going to be large pizza. And he sounded just like that. Pretty much. 100%. <laughs> And he, since he's hiked, knows what's up with the trail magic. Runway's got a blueberry New York bagel with cream um, cheese. We've got coffee, coffee, sodas. There's a Red Bull waiting for me, Gatorade, oh fruit. Gosh. Oh, I have a lid. All kinds of stuff. It's ridiculous. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, my goodness. And he came here at 6.30 a.m. Which is amazing. <laughs> Look what large pizza brought oh, upon request. Red Bull. I've had two, so we're definitely going to fly up that mountain here. Uh, and we've had other through hikers pillows and slice and um, bear bait and strawberry. Hey everybody, meet Hi. Silly Bams. Hi. Do you want to say where you're from and how you got your name? Sure. Um, I'm from the Raleigh area in North Carolina and I got my name about a week and a half ago um, because I was sitting at a picnic table at a shelter with a bunch of people and someone pointed at my wrist and they're like, are those Silly Bams? And I was like, heck yeah, they are. Aren't those, I, what decade are those from? Are those like 2000s? 2000s yeah. <laughs> when I was <laughs> when like in out. elementary school. Yeah. So I like laid them all out on the picnic table. And then one guy named Meat Suit was like, Meat Suit. Silly Bands, that's your new trail name. And I was like, heck yeah. <laughs> are you familiar with Slap Bands? Slap Bands. Oh, I know those with are. the little metal in it. Yeah. Those, oh, those yeah, were the I thing when I was are. in elementary. Yeah. And then they were banned because you could cut yourself with them, supposedly. We got banned. <laughs> we got silly bands banned at my elementary school. And I don't know why. That's funny. It might be Distraction. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man, that was so good. I had, get this, bagel, breakfast bagel, two coffees, two Dr. Peppers, two Red Bulls. So I guess we're flying right now. I don't know what's gonna happen later, but it's a good morning. Thank you so much, Large Pizza, you're the best. We got the lemon squeezer coming up. That's gonna be fun. There's some hikers back there we just passed. Passed, passed. That said, they just saw a bear up here. A bear. They were warning us about it, but I said, oh, thank goodness. Maybe it's not too late yet. Fingers crossed, guys, Oop, as I'm tripping. All right, we're within half a mile of the bear sighting. Keeping a close eye out, nothing yet. I think this is the area. I'm gonna be on high alert. Not a bear, but check out this tiny little baby fawn. Mama. Hi, baby. Yeah, I'm right here. It's okay. 
I will hurt you. All right, guys, I think I can give up on the bear. We have passed that area. I guess it just wasn't meant to be. However, we are about to enter the lemon squeezer. Woo! This is the first part. We go through a little cave. Woo! Isn't it cool? And then you gotta try to fit through this little part. <laughs> Can we fit? Oh, excuse my sweaty face. <laughs> it's a little humid today, okay? Can we fit with our pack on? I don't know. I doubt it. Oh, oh. already getting stuck. Ugh. Hardest part about this is doing this with one arm. Gotta go sideways. Gotta go at an angle. Making it. Making it. Getting squishy. Inching our way. Oh. Oh. Kinda stuck. Okay. We're moving. Getting more stuck. All right. Almost there. Oh. All right. Almost there, getting more stuck. Uh, wiggling our way through. Oh, oh, I have made it through the lemon squeezer with my back on. I feel like that's some sort of an award. <laughs> Woo! Wow, this is intense. Now we get to see how silly bands and runway do. Did you have to take your pack off? I think normally you are supposed to. I wiggled my way through with it on. Good luck to you. <laughs> what if I like climbed up it? I feel like I'm gonna dislocate my shoulder. <laughs> okay. Wow. Doing good so far. This is intense. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. <laughs> These are gonna make it. I gotta say, this is pretty entertaining watching <laughs> watching you try. <laughs> you don't have to go up. You can come straight through. I'm trying. It's a tight squeeze right there, though. Yeah. Whew. Okay. It's okay. Just hope my mesh pockets aren't ripped now. <laughs> oh well. Yes, you did Woo! it! Congratulations! Yay. I'm coming. <laughs> <laughs> Clawing my way through. Making it, like making it. Yes, so close, so close. Oh dear, my... Uh oh, that's the tight spot right there. <laughs> yes! Almost. I'm almost out. You this made looks, it! This looks narrower. You yeah, made maybe it. Maybe if I get on my tiptoes. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> and now we get to go up there. Yeah. All right, so. This, right after that little lemon squeeze, is the part that last time I climbed this, I could not, for the life of me, figure out how to make that jump right there. This year, I'm determined to do it. Wish me luck. Okay. I feel like New York needs to have, like, a disclaimer saying you must be a novice rock climber before you... <laughs> yeah, <laughs> really. That's for sure.
camera is going up here, so somehow I gotta make it up there. <laughs> You got it. Let's plan this out here. Maybe I could put a foot there and a crazy foot up here. Can you get your foot in one of those cracks where your hand was just now? Here. Yeah. Mm, I don't know. <laughs> You've got I'm this. I have to try and find out now. Just pull yourself up with your you arms <laughs> like a monkey. There you go. That looks good. Go. We're yeah. going to call you Flex. Oh Holy crap. That's amazing. Go, go. You got it. Oh, that was Woo amazing. Woo I definitely pulled something in my rear. Oh, no. <laughs> Woo. Right, Woo made it. Yeah. Woo. Okay, I'll try to get your pack. victorious. This isn't crazy. Oh, my gosh. You got this. Oh, that was amazing. Oh, that was amazing. Oh, that was amazing. Oh, that was I'll get it. I'll figure it out. Don't yell. Yeah, be careful. Oh, 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 there's a handle. Leave it to you to find the easier way up. No, not easy. There's like kind of a good one right over here. I think she's going to do it. Watch your head on the top. Okay. Yes. Oh, oh, oh my God. Yes. I didn't have to do the split. Yes! <laughs> Run away. Did the best climb yeah. out of all of us. That was the best route. <laughs> Good job. All right. I was shocked when I found that handhold. <laughs> nice. Nice. Boy, nice. don't we feel like winners now. <laughs> you know what's funny is that here in New York, the blueberries aren't even close to being ready. Need some more time. Maybe that means we won't see as many bears up here yet. When I first started learning about backpacking, the first thing I did was take a backpacking 101 overnight hike with REI. And this right here behind me is the very first water source where I ever filtered water. This is where I learned how to do it with REI's Sawyer filter, not even my own. This is a really, really a come full circle moment, I guess. It's like a look how far you've come text moment. So it's only appropriate that I get water here. And I slipped on that rock and got my shoe all wet. Oh well, can't win them all. I just had a flashback to that first night of camping with that REI class and they found bear scat at our campsite. And I remember being scared by that and I had to sleep very close to the instructors because I was scared a bear was gonna visit. <laughs> My how things have changed. Now I would pay a great deal of money to see a bear. <laughs> By the way, today's hike is just beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful area we're hiking through. Lovely weather, very sunny. Nice breeze and not too hot. Perfect. Another Goldilocks day today. My goodness, look at all the blueberry bushes, which is all of what you're looking at right now. All the way around. I bet when these are in season, this is like bear's paradise right here. Welcome to William Bryan Memorial Shelter. This was built by the CCC in 1933. It's one of the older shelters. Kind of neat. Welcome to Black Mountain, where you've got your finest views of the Hudson River on the trail, where Scully landed his plane. And also, right over here, Manhattan skyline. Pretty neat, huh? Nice view. Are y'all ready to play some Frogger? Because we're about to cross the Palisades Interstate Parkway. Whee! We're going there. I need to pass here. <laughs> oh boy. Maybe we'll wait for a little while. Wait 
Jeez. All right. All right. Oh, well, no. I, th I thought there was a gap. Not really. They really do need to build a bridge. You're right. All right. I think we got a gap coming up here. I think we got a gap. And ready. And go, 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 go. have to do that again for the opposite direction of traffic. Oh, this way is better. Must be more work traffic going the other way or something. Go! Woo! And safe. Hey, Seal Bands. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I surprised two wild turkeys and they flew off that way, but it was kind of cool. I just climbed over those last few steps and look where the turkeys were hanging out. 1,400 miles, woo! 1,400 miles, woo -hoo! Now that number feels good. We are making some serious progress, getting into huge digits now. Um, I don't know if I can calculate backwards, let's see. 2,193, so that's six. We've got over 700 to go but pretty soon we're really gonna start the countdown. Exciting. All right, we should have, um, I don't know, less than a mile to the shelter. Let's get on with it. Welcome to West Mountain Shelter. I'm very glad we pushed on to come to this one instead of um, William Bryan, because here's the shelter. Hey, um, silly bands. <laughs> I was, couldn't remember what silly bands were called for a sec. And look at this view! The same one, we've got the Hudson River and the New York City skyline. It's gonna be so pretty in the morning. Shelter, view. Shelter, view. Woo, excited. The shelter here is one of the two oldest shelters in New York. It was built in 1928, and it's one of only three non-hut shelters that were built before 1930 that are still in use today.